Hi guys. Latest update. This is the Cador Warjack, which I painted for um, one of my friend's sons. It's just a quick job, really. This is I've done it, done it with my airbrush, my new airbrush, just to see uh, what sort of effects I can get and you know how the highlights, how the highlights look and work. And, Used it for practice, really, seeing as it, seeing as it wasn't one of my models, which is dead handy. Um, I've done a quick paint job, basically. Um, I tried to uh, airbrush all of that steel inside of there. I tried to airbrush that first, and then blue tack it, and then go to the reds, so that I had a, a, a screen <clears throat> where it was uh, it was screened off to allow me to paint the actual reds of the key door. Look at this, and uh, hopefully get some nice effects without actually going over. A, all the silver guts that I did prior. Uh, unfortunately, after I'd done it all, getting the blue tack off is a nightmare. When it was pushed into crevices and pushed up inside there and things like that, it was an absolute nightmare to get it off. Really, really horrid. Don't recommend it at all. Wouldn't ever do it again. And the blue tack didn't actually screen all the red. So when I, when I pulled it off, there was bits of red on some of the steel. That. So basically I have to go over it all again with a paintbrush and, and redo it anyway. So next time I shan't be doing that. Next time I should be doing starting from the top and just working the inside in the guts with a nice brush afterwards. Um, I was gonna add with my airbrush some blast effects, you know, some black sooty effects on there or so, some of that, something coming off, but decided not to add it to the do job. So it's not really mine. So um, I think the the effects are on there as well actual highlighting and the shading probably better than I better than I could have managed with a brush um, it's quite good I'm hoping to do my next model which as promised is this color. the diatrol bomber hurry hurry I've been meaning to I've been threatening to get this fella for about three months I went down to Cut and Thrust Games in the centre of Bristol in the UK and I bought him for about £26 as an early Christmas present. There's his card. Speed 12, Strength 12, Map 5, Rap 5, Depth 12, Armour 18, Command 5. Powder Bombers, Cup 16, 2 Claws, 4 Fury. Animus bomb shelter, target friendly model gains girded. Bomb shelter lasts one round. The model with girded does not suffer blast damage. Friendly models base to base with it do not suffer blast damage. Range six inches. Bomber regeneration. This model can be forced to heal D3. And snack in. He has snack in as well. Here's the actual model itself. I'm filming on my iPhone, so it's a bit shaky. I haven't got the tripod out. Large base. This is chest. Set of legs. One arm. The head. Focus. Focus. Saddle, which the, uh, the little troll on the back rides on. Okay, that's 
the bits. A bit of modelling left to do. Uh, probably not a thin, I don't think it's a particularly good fit. stuff in and all the usual fun and games when it comes to putting these things together. Yeah, so not a great fit, so I'm going to have to spend some time putting this thing together. What I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll put it together hopefully uh, in the next couple of days and I'll update a new video release together and, and I've got a base coat on it. Of course I'm going to airbrush him and I'm going to give it a go with watered down P3 paints. The troll, I've got the troll blood colours so he's basically all skin so I'm going, to, I'm going to blast him with a lovely troll blood face and then slowly add the, add the highlight and things like that and see how we go. We will see how we go. Anyway, just a quick update showing you the Kador Warjack that I've done and it's hopefully looking as good as that. We shall see. Anyway guys, like it if you like it for me, leave us a uh, subscribe if you haven't, I'm going to be updating mostly, hopefully once or twice a week now, um, I'm developing a new website, possibly just to put this sort of content on and, and to see what sort of traffic I can drive to it, um, Girl Painting has agreed that she'll put all her videos on the, on the website I make as long as I link back to her channel, so I'm going to be doing that as well, um, and she updates at least once or twice a week, it's just a little hub, don't think we need another one to be honest, but um, something I like to do in my spare time. Anyway, like if you like it, subscribe if you haven't, 